morning, welcome to Titan TV. I'm Monica Hayes. Today is Tuesday, May 10th, and I'm Jordan Goddard, and now for today's announcements. Good luck to our baseball team as they take on Fletcher here at home in the first round of state playoffs today. The first pitch is at 4 p.m. Come and cheer your Titans on to victory. Come out this Thursday night at 6 p.m. for the sneak peek of next year's football team at the annual Orange and White game. Admission is $3. Reminder that the deadline for dual enrollment is coming up. The deadline for fall dual enrollment classes is May 27th. Don't wait until the last minute to schedule your appointment to see your counselor to complete your dual enrollment registration. There will be an interest meeting for UHS Titan Swimming during lunch on May 24th in room 4, 310. Any student interested in swimming for the 22 to 23 season should attend. Your books are on sale until we sell out. The cost is $85. You can purchase online or through the activities office. And now over to Dom with Titan Weather. Good morning. Happy Tuesday. It is a beautiful start out there. We're seeing plenty of sunshine. This is our live Titan Skycam shot over downtown Orlando. We are crystal clear. Not a cloud in the sky, but you might notice it is cooler this morning. It is breezier as we continue to see this north to easterly onshore flow and a trough sitting offshore that is uh, contributing to some dangerous water risk today. So we're under a high surf advisory through to, uh, Thursday evening for that high rip current risk and the potential for some of those large breakers out there on the seas. So, of course, use caution. Try to avoid the water at the beaches. Otherwise, it is breezy, gusty out of the north and northwest at about 10 to 20 miles an hour this morning. Temperatures in the low 70s where it is the upper 60s, up I-75, just a little cooler. We all warm up to the mid 80s, right around 84 today and pretty quiet. Throughout the day, future cast shows we're going to keep it quiet and comfortable in the upper 70s and the low to mid 80s under just a touch of cloud cover, but rain chances are going to be very, very, very isolated. Today, 81 for DeBerry, 81 in DeLand, upper 70s for the coastline. Tomorrow, very similar setup, maybe just a degree cooler, right around 80 degrees for DeBerry in Orange City. Still keeping an eye on the hazards offshore with wave heights anywhere from 6 to 8 feet. Of course, use caution if you're on the water today and tomorrow tomorrow. Through the rest of the week, we're going to be pretty quiet. Could introduce maybe an uh, isolated rain chance as we head towards late week as that uh, trough kind of lingers, but otherwise I think we're going to be pretty dry. Low 80s Thursday and Friday could see a rumble of thunder or an isolated shower. Then we start to dry out by next week. It's going to be getting hot again as high temperatures climb back into the mid-90s. Back to you, Annika and Jordan. That's all the news we have for you today. Thanks for watching. And remember, it's, it's all about, about the UHS. UHS.